Despite the fact that Hank was slain by Red Hood in Episode 3 of the third season, this week's episode shows him in the afterlife, reunited with his brother, and presently residing in purgatory. Richson spoke with Entertainment Weekly about quitting the program, saying that he loves where they left things and that he's willing to return if they need him in the future. Tim Drake who was shot at the end of the previous episode, wakes up in the afterlife and meets Donna Troy and Hank in Souls. They discover a way back to the living world by working together to build a bridge. Unfortunately, it begins to crumble as soon as they step on it, and they are ambushed by a horde of soul-sucking ghouls. Hank agrees to remain behind and fend them off so Donna and Tim can flee, and as a result, he is caught in the between. Fortunately, he is not alone, as he reunites with his brother Donnie the original Dove, and the two work together to save other souls trapped in purgatory. To put it another way, Hank was a hero all the way to the end and beyond. While talking to the EU Richson said, I spoke with the producers and writers before leaving, and was just very humbled by how gracious they were and how open-ended they left the conversation. Would you ever come back if we wanted to have you back? And I said, absolutely, I don't know if they'll ever feel like servicing Hank and that Hawk Dove storyline again, but I do love where we left it. I think it's really beautiful. This journey that Hawk was on mirrored my own life in such an eerie way. His ups and his downs really, I don't know who was channeling who, but it just seemed to really parallel where I've been in my journey, and the fact that he sort of crossed over, and he's made peace with that, and he's now living in a world where he has committed to continuing to help people and accept that. He further said I was content with the show. I really enjoyed the character, and I enjoyed the schedule. I have three young kids and a wife, and I want to see them grow up, and I'm always caught between this really difficult position of how much do I invest in my career versus how much do I invest in my family at home. I was on a show where I could come in, shoot a few days a week, and that's my contribution to that episode, and then I would fly to see my family. It's a luxury that I didn't take for granted because I've been the lead of a show before, and it's all-consuming, and you have no life. I would have stayed for 50 seasons probably if I'd never been confronted with leaving, but no really. The decision was made for me, and it was for the best. Richson recently landed the lead role of Jack Reacher in Amazon Prime Video's adaptation of the Lee Child novel series, but he said that being cast in the program wasn't the reason he quit the series, and that it was a concept from the Titans creative team before he got the Jack Reacher part. Please hit like and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.